So I just got back from the Okefenokee Swamp. Uh, me and my buddy went on an overnight trip. Uh, we canoed the whole thing. And I think we went 10 miles in and 10 miles back, roughly. The way this trip came about, um, he's writing a book and he wanted to get a first-hand experience of what the swamp was like so he could really feel what was going into his writing and uh, so he would have some background knowledge and he asked me to go along for the ride and you know me i don't pass up a good opportunity at a camping or hunting or fishing trip so i was all for it uh, so stay tuned as i go through and kind of show y'all what our trip was like here we go This is camp for the night. Took the walking trail in. I'll come check out this old cabin. These huge trees. Supposedly, this thing was left here from the logging days years and years ago, and they've just taken care of it and kept it up for people to use as they need to. See the old windows, old wood floors, wooden rafters. It's a good place to get out of the rain, if nothing else, but it's a neat old cabin. Got the table, got a door on this side, and then another room here. So 
So just all together a good place to hang our caps for the night. When we got to the cabin, I gave everything a good look over and I checked out the wooden floors and the wooden rafters and just the history of the building. And as I was checking out the front porch, I noticed there was a sign-in book for permits and there were a bunch of handwritten journal entries about different trips that people took. So I sat down and I tried to put into words kind of what our trip was like. And I also signed it and dated it. So if you're ever out that way and you're at that cabin, be sure to check it out. Thank you for watching the video and stay tuned for more videos like this one. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Y'all take care.